For the first time, scientists have been able to witness two neutron stars colliding and creating not only a black hole, but also birthing atoms that we find right here on Earth, like gold, silver, and even uranium. Imagine the sheer power behind this collision. These stars were so dense and their crash so intense that it transformed into one of the brightest events in the universe, called a kilonova. So, in this video, we'll break down how this incredible collision happened, the science behind it, and why it's a major breakthrough in our understanding of the universe and the elements around us. So, without further ado, let's get started. The story begins with two neutron stars, remnants of massive stars that exhausted their nuclear fuel and collapsed. Neutron stars are no ordinary objects. They're like cosmic fossils, incredibly dense, so much so that just a teaspoon of neutron star material would weigh about as much as a mountain. When two of these neutron stars are in close orbit, they begin to spiral toward each other losing energy in the form of gravitational waves. These ripples in space-time are like the sound waves of the universe, marking the intense gravitational pull between these dense stars. As they collide, these neutron stars produce a burst of energy that lights up space. This event, called a kilonova, releases light as bright as hundreds of millions of suns. Along with this, the collision gives birth to a new black hole, it's one of the most violent and powerful events we've observed. A neutron star crash that collapses under its own gravity to form a black hole. This observation has been possible due to the combined power of telescopes from across the world, with the Hubble Space Telescope capturing key details of the event. This lets us witness the birth of a black hole, one of the universe's most mysterious and extreme objects. It also provides astronomers a detailed look at the final moments of neutron stars, which hold clues about the forces that govern our universe. This is special because until now, black holes have been challenging to study directly. They're invisible to our telescopes. What's even more exciting about this neutron star collision is what it means for the elements that make up our world. During the crash, a process called rapid neutron capture, or the ER process, takes place. This is the magic behind the formation of heavy elements. When the neutron stars collide, temperatures soar to billions of degrees, similar to those just a second after the Big Bang. This intense heat, combined with a dense neutron-rich environment, allows atomic nuclei to capture free neutrons quickly. The ER process creates elements that are much heavier than iron, elements we can't get from regular stars, such as gold, platinum, and uranium. For the first time, scientists could observe these heavy elements in the cooling plasma left behind after the collision. Specifically, they detected elements like strontium and yttrium in the aftermath of the explosion providing evidence that other, even heavier elements were likely created during this event. These observations reveal a lot about how precious metals and other rare elements found on Earth are formed. That gold in a piece of jewelry, for instance, likely began in an event like this, in the violent collision of two neutron stars billions of years ago. This enhances our models of element formation, especially for those elements heavier than iron. These are elements that can't be made in ordinary stars. They need the extreme conditions of a supernova or a kilonova. Before, scientists could only theorize about this process based on computer models. Now, they've seen it happen, and they have concrete data on the temperature, speed, and composition of the matter involved. Neutron stars have long intrigued scientists with their extreme properties, leading to several landmark discoveries that have shaped our understanding of the cosmos. One of the earliest groundbreaking discoveries was the identification of pulsars. In 1967, astronomers Jocelyn Bell Burnell and Anthony Hewish detected rapidly spinning neutron stars that emitted beams of radio waves in a consistent pulse, which they termed pulsars. This discovery confirmed the dense nature of neutron stars, 
and demonstrated their intense magnetic fields, which emit detectable radiation. Pulsars became invaluable tools for studying neutron stars indirectly, as their regular pulses allowed scientists to measure properties like rotation and magnetic field strength, setting the stage for future insights into these enigmatic objects. Another major milestone came in 2017, with the first detection of gravitational waves from a neutron star merger. This observation, made by the LIGO and Virgo observatories, marked the first time that gravitational waves, light, and gamma rays were detected from the same cosmic event. It allowed scientists to not only explore the physics of neutron stars in collision, but also to examine how such events contribute to the formation of heavy elements. This discovery expanded our understanding of gravitational waves, previously observed primarily from black hole mergers, and demonstrated the unique ways neutron star collisions offer insights into areas of physics beyond even black holes. One of the biggest mysteries surrounding neutron stars is how matter behaves under such extreme densities, a phenomenon known as the equation of state. Each observation of neutron star mergers and individual neutron star characteristics offers clues about this behavior, even though the exact nature of this equation remains unknown. By studying variations in neutron star size, mass, and spin rates, scientists have gradually constrained possible models, each discovery adding to our understanding of matter under conditions that cannot be replicated on Earth. Thank you for watching, and we hope you enjoyed this journey through one of the universe's most spectacular events. If you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe for more cosmic insights. See you next time.